Ty Gibbs, you know, has the incident with Ty Dillon a couple of weeks ago. Last week he gets, you know, beat, you know, on the restart near the end by Amendinger. Is he, is he ready to handle all this stuff full time in Cup? You know what's most remarkable about Ty Gibbs is I didn't say what year. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you tried, yeah. <laughs> what, what's, you know, what, what, what really is 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 truly remarkable about Ty is you look at the number of reps he has as a driver rel relative to his peers, and and it's far fewer. Uh, you know, on on paper. Um, we didn't expect, I, I don't think anybody, including his father and grandfather, expected him to progress as quickly as he, as he has. And, and, and what we have to remember is, particularly if you contemplate him continuing to drive at the cup level, um, he's still got a lot to learn. And, and a driver as young as, I mean, he just turned 20, he's going to make mistakes. Um, what's more, most important is he has he has people around him that can that can keep coaching him up. Um, I, I do like the way he has matured even this year. You remember early in the season, and he was getting in and not just getting in into scraps, but once he got out of the car, he was handling that aggressively, right? And and so he's done much a better job handling the emotion once he gets out of the car and and for a driver to you know again as young as he is to to start um handling those situations is is good but but he's seeing he's still seeing things that that are new to him and uh and it's going to be a very dynamic you know time for him Hey, race fans, thanks for watching our video. For all NASCAR on Fox News content and the best clips from Fox Sports, be sure to follow and subscribe to our channel.